Welcome to the device replacement tutorial for iRule. This feature is only available with the Pro Builder license. Taking advantage of the device replacement feature will give you the power to replace devices in a project much faster than dragging and dropping individual codes. Now there's three basic ways to replace devices. On a panel level, on a handset level, and on a global level. We'll start with a panel level replacement. For sake of demonstration, let's say one of your customers has a single room set up right now and they want to add iRule to their master bedroom. They will have a direct TV receiver and a TV in their bedroom. We replace the devices at the panel level so we are only affecting panels and not the entire handset or project. In this instance, we only want to affect the master bedroom panels. First, copy and paste the watch TV panel and the drawers panel. Rename each of them by adding the room label in the properties tab. Now we can copy and paste the DirecTV and Panasonic TV device codes in the actions window. Remember, each device in the project must have its own set of device codes to function properly. Now we can relabel the device codes by clicking and changing the names in the properties window. All right, now we need to replace our devices at the panel level. Now there's two places we can do this. First is by right clicking on the panel itself inside the panels window, or by clicking on the replace button in the main window while that panel is still selected. We need to right click on the activity panel that we just renamed. In this instance, we are using the watch TV bedroom panel. This will bring up a drop down box. Go ahead and click the device that you want to replace with. This will bring up a device selection window. Select direct TV bedroom since we want those codes to be used in our panel. Go ahead, click preview and replace. And from here, repeat these steps for any other panels in your second room and you'll be all set. Since we are just going to use DirecTV in our example, we are done with our panel level replacement. Now let's look at the handset level. Let's say you have a customer that referred a friend, and they want the same setup as their buddy, but want to use their existing Panasonic Blu-ray player, Panasonic TV, and a Denon receiver. Using the handset replacement feature will replace multiple devices inside a new project. The same device replacement could be accomplished by using the panel level replacement that we just covered. However, the handset replacement will be much quicker because we will not just be clicking on each panel we want to replace devices on. Browse for our new devices. Go ahead and search your Blu-ray. Search Panasonic. We'll import that. And we'll go on down to our receiver. Search for our Denon receiver. Go ahead and import. And finally, we're going to look up our Panasonic TV. Now, once you've imported all of those, we're ready to replace the devices in our handset. Start by right-clicking on the handset that you want to replace the devices on. In this demonstration, we're going to use the iPhone. Click to replace devices from the drop-down menu. And select the devices that need to be replaced in the Replace Devices window. Go ahead and hit preview and then replace. Now our handset is ready for our new customer. We're now finished with our handset level replacement. All right, finally, let's look at replacing devices on the global level. Let's say you have a setup that uses several handsets and you want to replace devices across the entire project. For instance, replacing DirecTV with Comcast. We could accomplish this by either using the panel level or the handset level replacement, but the global level replacement will be much faster and we won't have to click on every single panel on our handset. First, we'll search for Motorola Cable Box. 
go ahead and search cable and type in Motorola. Go ahead and import, and then we're ready to replace our devices across the entire project. Start by right-clicking on the device that you want to replace, and in this demonstration, we'll replace the DirecTV satellite. Click Replace Device With and select the device that you want to replace the current device codes with. We'll replace the DirecTV codes with our new Motorola DCT codes. Click Preview and Replace. And that's it. Our project has migrated from DirecTV to Comcast in three quick steps. We hope that after watching this short video, you can feel more comfortable with the device replacement on any level in the iRule Builder. Remember, iRule has further instructions and support on all of our tutorials 24 hours a day, 7 days a week at iruleathome.com.